Hi guys, welcome back. Um, recently I have bought this sensor, the HCSR04. Um, basically with this sensor you can determine uh, the distance of an object in front of it. How does this sensor work? Well basically um, this sensor will send out uh, a sound wave and it will bounce uh, from the object back into the sensor. So basically what you can do in your program you can measure the amount of time it takes for sending the sound and receiving it back into the sensor and with that value you can uh, calculate the distance. So let's see how it works. Um, here I have set up uh, Arduino Uno and uh, I will plug in this sensor on the board uh, let me first uh, let you see the, the amount of pins you have four pins one is for the VCC one is for the trigger one is for the echo and one is for the ground so you need four so two are for the power supply, one is for triggering the pulse, and the other one is for receiving the pulse. So currently I already configured my uh, board uh, with a program that will uh, enable this LED when there is an object in front of it. Uh, actually it will only lit up if uh, I have three measures after each other of an object because sometimes it it will sp spot something different. So as you can see, if I hold my hand in in front of it, you can see that the LED will lit up for about two seconds, and then it will turn off. It will turn off because um, when I sense an object. I will uh, pause the program for a specific time to lit up the LED and after that it will reset the amount of measurements so it will take some time for the LED to light up again. Here is a close-up photo of the board. Um, you can see that the black and red uh, are for the power supply, basically 5 volts. Um, you can get the power supply from the Arduino board itself and uh, then you have the green wire uh, the green wire is the echo pin and it's connected to the digital uh, port uh, 9 of the Arduino board then you have the, the white wire which is uh, basically the triggering pin which is connected to uh, the digital pin 8 of the Arduino board and then you have the blue wire which is connected to the digital port 7 of the Arduino board and this one is for the LED and you can see the LED has a small resistor because the LED um, is uh, power hungry so the, the resistor is protecting the LED from burning up. This is a screenshot of the program uh, I wrote. Uh, I found an example on the internet and I modified it a bit. Uh, basically at the top, at the definitions, you can see which pins I'm using. So 8 is for the triggering pin, uh, 9 is for the echo pin and 7 is for the light pin. The amount of tries I set to 4. So basically I'm doing 4 measurements after each other. If those are 4 positive ones, then the LED will uh, lit up. Then I have uh, duration set to 20 milliseconds. Basically it means that the LED will uh, light up for 2 seconds before turning off. Um, then you have um, the variable A. A uh, is for the amount of measurements. So if I have four positives, then the LED will uh, lit up. The setup function will run only at the start of the program. Basically, you set the pin modes. So you can see that for the echo, it's an input and rest all outputs. And I turn off the LED. LED. The loop function will, um, will always loop, so basically during uh, program execution this function will run continuously until you uh, stop the board or uh, unplug the power.
So basically, first it does a measurement. Uh, it will run the function tp init. So basically, in tp, uh, TP init will return the amount of microseconds between sending the pulse and receiving it. Then you can use the other function called distance to uh, to calculate the distance to the object. Then there is a delay because yeah, otherwise you will uh, have a lot of measurements. So I set the delay to 50 uh, microseconds. I think it's 50 microseconds. Then I will uh, see what kind of measurement I got. So if it's between uh, 150 centimeters, if it is within uh, 150 centimeters, then I will uh, add up A. Basically, add a, a is the amount of measurements I did. And eventually, if I have four positive measurements, then the LED will turn on, which I do with the digital right Li low. And then I will delay. So basically the delay here, the, the duration is here uh, two, two seconds. And after that, I will uh, turn off the LED and A will be zero again. So basically this is the uh, function for the for this sensor and uh, maybe you you can use this uh, this program to make something on your own. There are lots of possibilities there, uh, with this sensor so uh, try something out.